But what you need to be doing is surrounding yourself with people that actually encourage your new self beliefs, okay, your new belief systems. So this is where, listen, if you're if your belief is that this person is coming back into your life, but the people around you are like kind of, you know, um, dismissing it, they're just like, no, that person won't come back, whatever, you just, you know, just move on, blah, blah, blah. They're like, they're stopping you, okay, because they're reinforcing that negative narrative, they're reinforcing the, the different story, not your new story. So listen, yeah, if you want your wish fulfillment of this reunion, be very careful who you surround yourself with and ultimately who you listen to. Do you want this happy ending? Do you want this positive outcome? Remember, happiness is an inside job, okay? Right now, you're very overwhelmed, especially emotionally. Like, it's almost like you don't know how to feel. There's so many different things going on for you because your intuition's telling you one thing, aka, like, this is your person. And then all this self-doubt is creating, like, your ego is creating all this self-doubt. And all you're doing is essentially lying to yourself. All you're doing is sabotaging yourself. You're just trying to make good of a bad situation, okay? You're not moving forward here. You may think that you are, but actually all you're doing is just putting like a mask on, a front on, because especially the people around you who are doubting what you are trying to manifest into your life, it's like you have to put a mask on to be like, well, I don't care anyways, but actually you do care. Of course you care. The bloody king of cups and the hierophant with the high priestess. Well, first of all, the priestess and the hierophant, divine counterparts, okay? Highly spiritual divine counterparts. This is how I know this is a highly spiritual connection. Like, so deep. Like, the soul tie here is, ooh, strong. And as I was saying with the king of cups in part one, like... This person loves you. Like, this person has such strong feelings towards you. Both of you do, okay? Both of you have such strong feelings towards each other. Heavy water sign energy coming through. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. And also Earth energy. Taurus in particular. Jesus Christ, yeah. Right now, you're at a crossroads. And if you're at a crossroads, I feel like your person's also at a crossroads. You've both tried to move on, okay? How long has it been? Ask yourself, how long has it been? For a lot of you, we're talking years, okay? For a lot of you here, we are actually talking years. And between three and five years is kind of what I'm getting, especially. So for some of you, that could be a specific time scale, regardless of that, okay? It's like you're both, yeah, you're both ready for this new beginning. You're both ready for this new stable beginning. You're both ready to move on together, but yeah, there's still something holding you back here because being together again will be a huge transformation. And are you both